And now it's time to continue our two-a-days coverage. If you missed Rose Pine or Oakdale yesterday, you can find those previews on our website. But next up are the Pickering Red Devils. The Pickering Red Devils have had a couple disappointing seasons, going winless the past two years, but new head coach John Doherty is focusing on rebuilding the program. Uh, we don't have a lot of numbers. Uh, the ones that are here, they're working their tails off. Uh, they're soaking in knowledge. They're, they're wanting to learn. They're wanting to be better. Um, I kind of feel like, you know, that there's a lot of kids on campus that could probably help us, but with the last few seasons, they, you know, have fallen off the off the radar with the football program and so we're trying to you know get the program up and running and, and get some excitement back into the community and hopefully some of those those athletes will join us but uh they're they're very attentive they're very coachable kids the ones that i have here and that, that will go a long way sophomore quarterback Braden ford knows this team has a lot of work to do but he believes they have the right pieces to put them back in the win column I for sure can't say that we're not the strongest, we're not the fastest, we're not the biggest. We're not the, big, we're not the best in anything, but we have the hardest work and we're coming out and we're ready to prove that. We're ready to come back and put Pickering back on the maps. With low numbers and a team full of young players, the Red Devils are going to have to rely on their leadership to lift the team up when faced with adversity. In order for my players to do better, I have to do my hardest so they, because I need to inspire them for them to give it their all. So, I don't give them all, what kind of captain am I? The Red Devils open up their season on the road against Elton on September 1st.